it's uh <clears throat> I just want to show you guys on Google Chrome I installed it just to show you guys what it shows up you see notice on Google Chrome the actual uh, ad where it pops up right away see notice how this thing's here this is not part of it this should be totally gone so uh, this is part of the advertisement and if you notice here once you hover over it, it actually tells you uh, what the site is if you Google that site that's the virus but I'm gonna show you guys how to get rid of it and your Google your uh, Firefox uh, any browser you have on here Safari will work just fine after this thing's removed okay here's the files that you need to remove from your libraries uh, folder uh, and your uh, system folder if you notice I mean you're not you probably are not gonna find all these files but you do need to remove uh, all of them anything everything says V search here notice how everything says V search that's actually the the, the virus uh, so well, what you need to do is you need to delete these files all of these folders right here anything file or folder whatever you see on here you want you want to delete okay so um, uh, let me just delete the files I'm not gonna show you but you should be able to just go under the C drive and, and delete the files themselves I mean I'm not gonna actually just put the the camera record this because you're probably gonna bore you you already see this and I'm gonna post this also on the description of the of this video so you guys can actually go back to reference the, the file that you need to delete okay talk to you later bye okay here's the very first one application support so I went to the site and this is the folder you need to get rid of so all you need to do is drag it and drop it on the recycle bin and then delete the, the, the uh, permanently delete the files from the recycle but here's the first one okay I'm gonna just turn it off the camera again and then show you the next file okay notice under launch demons you have one two three files so let's see if we have these we have one here there's one uh, and there's two okay so you only have two of them here so that should be fine we can just get rid of those two those two files you're not gonna again you're not gonna find all the files that are on this list but you do delete the ones that you find okay the very last file is under system library frameworks and then it's going to be search that framework so um, for that one um, libraries and then frameworks frameworks and then we'll look for vsearch we'll see this this is an actual this is very the system files you don't want to mess a lot with because uh, there's a lot of uh, system files here that's why you want to back it up first if you ever if you need the, the the information off this computer if you think you're gonna have an issue and if just to be careful back up your information first so here it is right here research framework that's the one you want to get rid of once you do that you'll be set so let me get rid of that file and then I'll uh, go to the browser again and show you guys that it's no longer there Okay, I'm back on Google now. Notice how I'm, I'm back on Google. Notice that the the ads no longer here because we got rid of the, the the actual files that were overriding the the putting the banners on top of it. So it's it's a very nasty virus. I just seen it, and I think it's a new virus that actually that's infecting the, the Mac browsers. It's, uh, well, I mean, I don't know if I want to call it a virus, but it's just a nuisance or just a, a pop-up that you want to get rid of. And there's no way to get rid of it. You can install any pop-up blocker on your browser, and it's not going to fix that issue. So I'll show you again. So I'll go back here. Uh, let's get... Okay, if I go to Google. And no longer the ad's on. Okay, if it's not on, if it doesn't show up within the next four or five minutes, you're good to go. You you actually removed it, so uh, I'll be posting this video shortly. Uh, if this video helped you in any way, please support our channel by subscribing and clicking like, and we will put more videos up to help people out. So this is on a Mac computer. This will work on any Mac OS. Just look for those files. They will they're on the on the bottom at the description below and you'll uh, you'll be able to uh, remove them if you need to just you can actually just uh, copy and paste them on uh, 
a notepad or word and just print them out so that way you can actually just go in there and delete them it should take you no more than five minutes to get rid of all those files again this is just to remove the pop-ups that come up on, on the browser so it's just uh, interesting uh, virus that I've seen and got rid of it so hope this helps out get some people out and help save you some cash um, if you want us to do it and you're in the area you want to bring it in we can more than, we'll be more than happy to do it for you uh, for a very small fee okay uh, we can also remote into your machine and remove the, the files uh, contact us by via email call us uh, our fee for remote support is uh, $29 and we will need a major credit card and then we can remote into your computer and clean that out for you alright uh, again thank you and until we post the next video bye